Hi people and welcome to another CameraHorders.com digital camera video preview. Today I have Nikon Coolpix P520 digital camera. As you can see this is ultra zoom camera. It has 42 times optical zoom which translates into 24 to 1000 millimeters in 35 millimeter terms. Also this camera has 18 megapixel sensor tiltable LCD display which can also be closed in order to protect it electronic viewfinder and all sorts of other functions it has GPS receiver and can record the video at full HD quality with stereo sound as you can see this is left and this is right microphone the good thing about this camera it has expo manual exposure modes besides full automatic and also has uh, customizable buttons. For example, this one FN button over here can be reassigned to a function of your desire. Right, right now I have ISO value, but you can select almost anything else. Drive mode, metering modes, white balance, and so on. Optical zoom can be controlled using this dial over here and using this one over here. But the good thing is uh, Nikon Coolpix P520 allows you to reassign this button over here and right now I use it for manual focus. That, that is, this is a very good thing because this camera requires sometimes a li little bit more time to autofocus when using maximum telephoto. So you only select focus to manual and now you use this dial. As you can see the focus is now changing. The good thing about this camera is also that it has twin control dials. This one over here and the one where your thumb uh, usually rests. If you select for example manual exposure mode you can use the upper one for exposure value as you can see and the lower one for aperture value. Also there, there is a detail that is quite strange on this camera. Uh, it uses electronic viewfinder but there is no way to select it manually. For example some cameras have proximity sensor so when you put the camera to your eye it automatic, uh, automatically switches to electronic viewfinder. This is not the case with this camera and also if you push this display button it does nothing but changes layout on LCD. If you want to use electronic viewfinder the only way to use it is simply to close the LCD. Now this is kind of weird because if you want to shoot using electronic viewfinder and review images on LCD each time you want to review image you have to open the LCD. It's kind of pointless to me but it is like this. Of course pop-up flash is built in and the camera has metal tripod mount and uses lithium battery and standard SD memory cards. Ok this is more or less everything I wanted to show you about this camera and I invite you to my blog CameraHorders.com where you can read the entire review and take a look at image samples from this camera. Thanks for watching.